There may soon be a new, clean way to power your home. Tesla Motors is known for its electric cars. But last night, the company launched a battery they say could power an entire house. Rene Filippone has the details on that battery. It could start a clean energy revolution. The only light at this nighttime event came from energy stored in this, the brand new power wall. Uh, what I'm going to talk about tonight is about a fundamental transformation of how the world works. About Tesla CEO and tech billionaire Elon Musk energy. wants people to generate solar power and store it in the new batteries. The issue with existing batteries is that they suck. Okay. <laughs> Making smart investments. The idea is eventually homes will generate their own electricity with solar power, which is stored in Tesla batteries for later use. Right now, the $3,500 battery is a pretty pricey backup system. $400 for a solar panel like this. Olivier Tricassis is an engineer at the University of Toronto. He says there are similar batteries on the market, but Tesla has an advantage. The amount of money that they have is, uh, is really astounding, absolutely. <laughs> That money is paying to build the biggest battery factory in the world. Tesla says that will bring down costs. If you think about the, you know, the internet revolution that happened in the 1990s, this is another revolution that's happening in energy. So whereas in the 90s we spread, you know, information to the entire world, now we're, sp we're spreading clean energy to the entire world. For Tesla, their electric car was just the starting point to change the way the world uses and stores power. Musk admits it's a super crazy idea, but possible. Critics agree, but say the change won't happen overnight. So we don't yet have the right regulatory uh, environment to be able to accommodate uh, these sorts of resources. So for instance, when somebody uh, installs a battery in their house, they're not disconnecting from the grid. They still expect the grid power to be there. And the upkeep on that grid is expensive. Canada's energy producers say that while the rich may be able to afford the new technology, right now most Canadians rely on the grid and will have to foot the bill for it. Renee Filipponi, CBC News, Toronto.